welcome back to my channel. I'm back with yet another video and this is going to be a um, quasi unboxing, not the real unboxing because of course I already opened this, uh, of a collaboration jacket between uh, Barber uh, and Deus or Deus Ex Machina. Um, a kind of take on a classic Barber motorcycle jacket for the summer from these two great companies. Um, here I have it still kind of in its um, a baggie that it came for. It, I still have all the um, paperwork for it um, because I actually didn't wear it yet. And um, this one is, you know, lightly in a lightly washed kind of vintageized uh, color. Um, before I go into that, so it is a barber jacket. Um, in collaboration with, as you can see here, Deus Ex Machina. So Deus Ex Machina, if you're not, uh, if you don't know, or Deus Ex Machina, and I apologize if I'm butchering this name, guys, uh, guys, is a company from Australia, I believe, that um, came on the market in 2006 with some of the um, kind of customized motorbikes, and then later on got into you know adding some accessories and then get into the clothing line and t-shirts and jackets and whatnot. And Barber, we all know um, it's um, you know a really old traditional English company um, that's mostly known for the waxed jackets, uh, but Dale, Beaufort, and they are you know really traditional old. Uh, I think they date back to 1890 something. I'm not sure. Um, but you know they have been around forever. So here's the jacket itself Let's dig into it and to see how it looks like. So it's a summer jacket So it's very light the color is kind of washed out blue uh, Meaning there is a lot of distressing on this jacket But as the jacket itself the design wise it's a traditional um, You know kind of motorcycle inspired three-quarter eight a seven I would call it design uh, wise from Barber but you know very lightly done um, with very nice details um, from Deus Ex Machina so from the overall perspective as I said it's a three-quarter jacket lengthwise on the back of course it has the belt which is removable um, so you can cinch the jacket around you and then on the front you have you know one pocket over here and another pocket over here which you can see it is at an angle and the idea behind this is that this supposedly you know kind of was the map pocket so it was easy or you know a document pocket so it's very easy to get in and out of this pocket um, and actually see uh, because if you look at how I look down onto it I can actually see what is inside if I open it there you go and then it has one more pocket here and another one down here and it has a little you know barber deus x machina patch leather patch here to you know kind of signify that this is a collaboration between these two brands um the all of the stud buttons are you know uh, marked says Barber and Deus X as on the leather patch and um, you know they are originally they were this kind of color brass color as you can see inside but the, on the outside they vintageized them so as you can see here it's very it's a kind of new brass look still and then as you can see here uh, you know this kind of like stone washed brass and I don't know how I would call that but it's a really nice, you know, detail. And all of the buttons are like that. So also on the pockets. And also on the neck color. Here. There we go. Um, the color is kind of uh, stitched with more stitches. And here you can see it's a very nice, I can show you guys here how the wash is done. So it's a distressed kind of washing and it kind of makes this piece um, look old, although obviously this is a brand new piece. Then we have some extra padding with uh, stitching on the shoulders. 
there we go you can see it here that's a very nice addition i mean there's no functionality really to it you know you cannot you know this is not the jacket it's gonna protect you you know it doesn't have any armor or you can't insert armor this is more of you know a free time jacket it's not really functional but i guess you could wear it also on a motorbike if you wish so especially now in the summer in the city i think it's a great piece um you know you can't expect a lot of protection from it but you know it's for sure gonna look very nice so these are pretty much the features features as i said so one two three four pockets on this jacket uh, a neck collar which is removable and detachable here and then the way you get into this jacket is you just unbutton these buttons and you have also a zip inside uh, inside of the jacket i have checked last time but just to be sure aside from the bottom pocket here it says again barber uh deus ex and this is an xl size and i'll talk about sizing in a second uh, there is one pocket here which I guess it's a phone pocket, but I don't know if, uh, and luckily I have my phone here. So this is a iPhone 6s, the normal size, another plus. Yeah, and this one fits perfectly in here. I didn't try that yet, as you can see. And then I can, you know, there is a little um, closing piece here. I can close it and the phone is securely in there. So that's good. Um, judging by the size, I think even the iPhone 6 Plus might fit in here and, you know, get close. If anybody's interested, leave me a comment downstairs and I'll try that to be the iPhone 6 Plus because I have one but just not handy next to me. And that's on the one side and on the other side um, there is nothing. So there are no pockets here on the inside of this jacket, but I think you don't need them because you have four external pockets as it is, as I already showed. All right, so now let me put it on so you guys see how it fits on me. Um, the, the fit is generous. Um, this is not one of those really slim line jackets, so it's a very traditional fitting jacket, but you can make it look slimmer because of the belt in the back. Um, so let me zip it. There we go. And this is it let me try to move the camera a bit down so we try to get i get more in the picture so this is how the jacket looks like and you know the head's not the best um the best uh, for this so as i said you know you you zip it and then you have the buttons to to close it up and here you can see you know how this pocket is angled um and it features a really nice thing this is like a flap and you know if you get an a7 on a motorcycle jacket which is waterproof this is helping to keep the water outside um, if you get into the rain but obviously here it's more of a design feature i don't think you know the jacket i mean for sure is you know not uh not a waterproof jacket so there you go size wise guys i'm a chunkier guy i have 182 centimeters um and i have the chest around 120 centimeters there they're about and this is a size XL and it fits me perfectly um, so it is a larger size you know it's not an Italian sized kind of jacket I would say you know European confection is like a 56 58 jacket there they're about and then of course you have the belt uh, which I didn't prepare to take forward now let me see if I can unravel it in the back and in the meantime I'll come closer so you guys can see some of these details of this wonderful jacket there and this i should have mentioned this piece so when you close it up then you can you know close also this up i'm not gonna snap the button now in but you get the idea this is like to protect you know the wind blowing here because this is you know a bit open but you don't need to i mean you don't need to use that if you want or you don't want and also you can detach it completely this piece uh, should you not want to have this on the jacket um, but at the moment I have left it on mine because I do actually plan to use mine on my bike so here's the belt and you know honestly speaking with my uh, posture um, I will most probably not use the belt because um, I am challenged around the belly area and uh, the belt does not let's say do me um, do me justice uh, or it doesn't make me you know it doesn't make the jacket sit better on me 
uh, then without the bed so most probably I will remove it but I just wanted to show you guys how it looks like if you you know if you attach it and that there it is this this jacket as I said is very very light one thing it, it's you know it kind of struck me is that the I'll try to demonstrate that that the the sleeves are quite short on this jacket which is okay for me because I have short hands and they are very very wide again I appreciate it in this area here because my arms are quite thick here uh, but you know they, they are wider than your normal and I think this is you know you, you, you see what I'm talking about but again you know not a problem for me um, price wise these jackets when they came out um, color wise price wise so colors you have this blue denim kind of washed out color which I think is absolutely beautiful um, then you had I think like a green one and I think there was a yellow one um, and the original price in Europe was around 270 euros uh, I have seen one in my barber outlet in Austria let me lift up the camera a bit guys now sorry I'm doing this all like this okay yeah so this is better so I seen one in Austria in the outlet for I think around 120 discounted so it was almost it was 50 50 off so 130 but I got this one on the final sale uh, and I paid 90 euros for it I know also endclothing.com had and this is no by no means any commercial for them uh, but I saw you know they had on a final 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 sale they were um, doing them for 89 euros which I think it's a great you know it's a great price for this kind of jacket you know because it is a quality item and a really nice jacket for now if you go out in the evening it's a bit chillier you know this is a great jacket to have uh, it wears great on slacks it wears great on jeans obviously um, you know it is not it is a bit of a um, you know it's definitely a casual piece it's not you know um, it's not something that you would like probably to wear um you know somewhere formal but you know for that what it is it's a great piece again it's motorcycle inspired but it's not really you know it's not really for um you know using on a bike if you're asking you know to to get the motorbike protection but if you're fine you know just for whizzing around town this jacket i think is a is a good jacket to have there we go guys this is my unboxing and review overview of this what i believe is a gorgeous collaboration piece from Barber and Deus Ex Machina or Machina or there we go and there are some tags this one is from Deus Ex there we go then you have some care leaflet and of course the Barber traditional piece and here is the if anybody is interesting interested these are the codes fresh blue is the color and then it says washed gelong casual in size excel and there is the serial code and this brings us to the end i hope you have enjoyed this video guys thank you so much for watching um thank you for subscribing and liking the videos it really means a lot to me um and i'll see you in my next video but for now i wish you a great day bye